Well, hello, Sally. Hey there, Pastor. Oh. Oh. Oh, <laughs> Sally. I'm not used to hearing you like this, Sally. Usually you're as happy as can be. What's got you down? Well, Pastor, I'm just frustrated. Well, we all get frustrated, Sally. Well, this here is real frustrated. Oh, dear. Well, how frustrated are you? Oh, Pastor, I'm as frustrated as a one-legged cat in a litter box. I just can't <laughs> get the job done. <laughs> that, that, that is frustrating. Yeah. Yep. What's eating you, Sally? Well, Pastor, every, everything seems to just be going wrong. I started the week getting into a fight with my brother, Joey. Then on Tuesday, I got in a little argument with my parents, and then they grounded me. This week of yours has the making of a country song. You know, I thought about emailing Shania Twain, giving her the material, but I have to copyright it first. <laughs> Indeed. But you know the worst of it, Pastor? What's that? The worst of it is that with all these difficulties, I prayed the entire time through each one, but they just kept on coming. You know what? I'm kind of ashamed to admit it, but it got me doubting God a little. Oh, that's serious, Sally. I know, Pastor. As I said, I'm not proud of it, but it's true. Well, Sally, I can't say that I don't understand because I do. You do? Sure I do. When we go through difficult times and we ask God to help us, sometimes it seems like he's not listening. That's exactly how I feel, Pastor. I mean, I'm taught to pray. I did the praying, but the things seem to go from bad to worse. I mean, it seems like God's sleeping. I know, but let me try and encourage you. Well, I need it. I'm just as discouraged as trying to explain colors to a blind man, I'm telling you. <laughs> that is discouraging. Oh, indeed. <laughs> well, listen here, Sally. When Jesus was dying on the cross, it seemed like God wasn't listening to all the disciples and people who believed in Jesus. I mean, how could Jesus dying be a part of God's plan? Well, if Jesus didn't die, Pastor, our sins wouldn't be forgiven. Then we'd be in a whole heap of trouble. You know that, and I know that. But at the time, the people didn't know that. And that's actually the point. You see, God was doing something wonderful. He was dying for the sins of the world. But at the time, the people didn't understand what God was doing. They thought God wasn't listening when actually he was answering their deepest need. Huh. So let me get this straight. I might not think God's listening, but just like the people didn't get what God was doing on the cross at the time, but they later we knew, maybe I'm going to look back on this bad week and see what God was doing. Exactly. We just have to trust him that he's good and he'll always care for us. You know what, Pastor? I feel better just knowing that God's always listening does help. Amen, Sally. Amen. Let's pray. Say, dear God. Dear God. Thank you. Thank you. That we can trust you. That we can trust you. No matter what. No matter what. Amen.